2,000 local suppliers have turned up here in Perth to hear more about the multi-billion dollar Roy Hill Iron Ore Project, which is in the Pilbara in northern Western Australia. Now, the suppliers are hearing information about uh, contracts, for example, for electricians, plumbing, building. Now, at its height, the project will employ about 8,000 people that's in the construction of the project. When the mines opened in 2015, it's expected to export about 55 million tonnes of iron ore every year. The project includes construction of the mine, of a railway, a 344 kilometre railway to Port Hedland, and also a port to, of course, to export the iron ore. Now, we heard tonight from the Chief Executive Barry Fitzgerald. He said that project financing is still being worked on, but negotiations are progressing satisfactorily. And also, Mr Fitzgerald tonight spoke about the controversial enterprise migration agreement that Roy Hill was granted. Now, he said tonight that given the slowing economy, it's very likely that Roy Hill will in fact employ most of its workforce in Australia. In terms of recruiting, uh, and at that time we needed to be able to demonstrate that we uh, had an opportunity to manage the risk of not being able to get experienced, capable resources, so we signed up and started the EMA process. We've got that agreed in principle, but we don't have it in reality. However, since that time, things have moved on. We are now confident that uh, we will, in fact, secure the bulk of our workforce or our contractors will through the Australian labour market. The local suppliers that have come here are everything from uh, hydraulic manufacturers to fridge manufacturers to building companies, and they say they're hopeful of gaining some work in what is a slowing economy. I mean, um, as a tradition owner, I like to uh, see that a uh, royal do honour and do uh, give us an opportunity in the in the in the business. This project is very important. Um, as you can see, there's everyone's you know, we'll need uh, looking for work opportunities like ourselves so, um, and just hope you know, things pick up but it's very important this Roy Hill project and yeah it looks like it's moving forward. We're keen to find out what the opportunities are for uh, a local construction company that does a, a fair bit for the government uh, to diversify and see what other opportunities are out there and with uh, this sort of project right on our doorstep we're keen to get involved with, uh, with other companies and, uh, and be part of it.